Why such resolve? Because I believe in Italy. I'm betting on Italy. Italy has saved me again and again. It has been my constant. And I believe in dreams and their ability to become reality. This is Kathy McCabe. Welcome to the Dream of Italy podcast. You know me from the PBS travel series, Dream of Italy, and the award-winning website and publication. Join me as we explore the sights and sounds of Bell Italia. From the canals of Venice to the piazzas of Puglia, from the fashion houses of Milan to the vineyards of Tuscany. Hop on, it's gonna be a great ride. Andiamo. I'm Kathy McCabe, and what a different world we are living in now since the last time I talked to you. It's just me on this episode, but in a few minutes, I'd like to share how you can join me here on a future episode. First, some truly lovely news in the midst of the current coronavirus madness. On April 9th, the New York Times featured the Dream of Italy podcast as one of 13 podcasts for wandering souls. Reporter Stephanie Rosenblum wrote, Scenes of piazzas, arcaded streets and markets float through this podcast with Kathy McCabe, the host of the PBS Dream of Italy series. There are just a handful of episodes, though they evoke a sense of place, particularly those with Francis Mays, the author of Under the Tuscan Sun, who talks about the slow life in the Italian countryside. I love how this podcast can connect all of us to Italy and what Italy and Italian culture represents to all of us about what makes life worth living. When the news came in that the entire country of Italy was in lockdown, or grounded, as Frances said, she always has the right words. I was in our TV edit room working on my most ambitious project yet, a Dream of Italy special for PBS stations and Create TV about the transformative power of Italy. When I say ambitious, I mean not only in content. This goes beyond travel to a range of ways Italian culture can help us live better. But in the financial risk I also take to bring this show to air. I will admit I had a moment, literally just a few seconds, where I questioned what in the world we were doing. Sometimes you have to ask the question, though, to know you are on the right path. I answered it with more resolve than ever to keep moving full steam ahead. And we did until our own lockdown here in the United States caused us to have to pause. Why such resolve? Because I believe in Italy. I'm betting on Italy. Italy has saved me again and again. It has been my constant. And I believe in dreams and their ability to become reality. As Italy begins to slowly open up and the future still remains uncertain, all we can hold on to these days are our dreams. So let's write about and talk about our Italian dreams. I know Dream of Italy viewers, readers, and listeners have had some of the most incredible experiences in Italy. We've published 170 issues of our award-winning travel publication, but you know about so many hidden gems that I, or the fabulous contributors to our publication, don't know about, and what better time to share them. For years, I have dreamed of putting together a crowdsourced issue of Dream of Italy, and now that we also have the Dream of Italy podcast, for those who don't like to write but can talk... We're compiling a crowdsourced podcast episode as well. I need your help. There's no better time to show our love for Italy and get lost in a little project that has us digging deep into great memories. Please submit a 350-word article, series of photos, recipe, or podcast soundbite up to 40 seconds long on the theme of When I Dream of Italy, I Dream of dot, 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 <laughs> to potentially be included in our issue or episode. The deadline is May 20th, 2020. The more specific you can be with details invoking the five senses, the better. Don't worry about getting it exactly perfect. 
If we need to make edits, we will get in touch with you. Everyone who submits content fitting the guidelines will be entered to win a three-night stay with your place in Florence anytime in 2020 or 2021, or a one-week personalized Italy itinerary planned by me, not including actual travel expenses. If we publish your submission, we will award you with a six-month membership to Dream of Italy, which will give you access to our vast archive of 170 back issues, as well as new information-packed issues coming up. We definitely also plan to have an ongoing crowdsourcing opportunity with the publication and podcast. So if you're listening to this episode after May 20th, 2020, you can still submit for future consideration. Get all of the details at dreamofitaly.com slash share my dream. Dreamofitaly.com slash share my dream. Here's an example of what you might submit for a podcast soundbite. Start out with your name in either your geographic location or your company name and the words, when I dream of Italy, I dream of. So, I'm Kathy McCabe from Dream of Italy. When I dream of Italy, I dream of a small restaurant kitchen in the postcard perfect town of Savigno in the green hills of Emilia Romagna. The sounds of meat sizzling and jazzy music playing fill the background. I'm here with Nona Anna, who makes up for her small stature with her giant cooking prowess. Our energetic, frenetic, passionate, mutual friend Alessandro Martini of Italian Days Food Experience has brought us together for this Italian grandmother to teach me to make her recipe for ragu. If I promise not to share, Anna whispers her secret ingredient, the meat from the heel of the prosciutto. If you would like to submit your own podcast soundbite on the theme of When I Dream of Italy, I Dream Of, email a voice memo to sharemydream at dreamofitaly.com or get all the details on how to submit at dreamofitaly.com slash sharemydream. For tips on how to craft your article or podcast script, watch my Facebook Live video on travel writing on the Dream of Italy Facebook page. I look forward to reading and hearing about your Italian dreams and know that we are all holding tight for the new renaissance that is surely in the works for Italy and for all of us. For show notes on this episode, visit dreamofitaly.com slash eight. If you haven't yet, be sure to subscribe to the Dream of Italy podcast on Apple Podcasts and leave us a review. Five stars preferred. For more about all of our podcast episodes and to give us feedback on what you would like to hear in the future, visit dreamofitaly.com slash podcasts. And for all things Dream of Italy, the award-winning travel publication, membership website, TV show, and travel planning service, visit dreamofitaly.com. Ciao!